Hello everyone, and welcome to this video on how to compile and run the embedded sample code of BoldBI on your machine. This embedded sample has integrated dashboard examples into the ASP.NET Core application using BoldBI Embedded SDK. We have provided support for platforms such as Angular, Blazor, and React with Go and more. Let's explore the sample embedding of the ASP.NET Core application. You can find the sample in the GitHub branch Quick Bold BI Embedded ASP.NET Core Sample under the Samples repository. You can find the GitHub branch location in this video's description. This README file will guide you on how to run your application. Initially, I will show you a demo of the sample application, which directly retrieves dashboards from the demo server, and later, I will show you a demo on how to configure this sample application using your launched Bold BI server credentials. Let me show you the demo by directly launching the sample application. First, check out the development branch using the URL on your local machine. You'll find a samples folder. Open the folder, and then open the scenario-based samples folder. Here, you will see the ASP.NET Core embedded sample. Open the folder, and then open the solution file in Visual Studio IDE. Now, clean and build your solutions to restore the referred packages for the embedded sample. Open the appsettings.json file. By default, all the properties will be filled properly. You need to just compile and run to view the embedded sample on our demo server. Let's run the ASP.NET Core application. Now the ASP.NET Core application is launched. Here, you will see the embedded sample loaded with a set of dashboard examples and the page split into two sections. One is the dashboard section, and the other one is the property section. In the property section, you can find the select dashboard dropdown, which holds a set of dashboards, dashboard ID, and path. Now let me show you how to load an embedded dashboard. To do that, click the select dashboards dropdown, where you will find a list of dashboard examples. Here, I will select Cell's Lead Tracking Dashboard and click Load Dashboard icon to preview the dashboard. Now the dashboard is loaded in the Dashboard section. This Cell's Lead Tracking Dashboard provides a detailed breakdown of a company's lead and account details. So far, we have seen the samples by directly launching the sample application using the demo server. Next, let me show you the demo on how to run sample application for your installed and deployed Bold BI server. Provide your Bold BI server credentials in the appsetting.json file. Set the URL like this for enterprise, and set URL like this for cloud. Set the site identifier like this for on-premise, and an empty string for cloud. Then, set the environment here. User email is the email ID of the Bold BI server that authorizes the application. Next, set the embed secret for authentication. You can also refer to the documentation provided in this video's description to generate the embed secret key. After completion of the appsettings.json file properties update, go to the Solution Explorer panel and search for the dashboard.cshtml page. Click on it and you'll be redirected to the page. Here, provide your Bold BI server dashboard details. Data ID represents the dashboard ID, data path represents the dashboard path, and dashboard name for identification to load the correct dashboard. You can add a list of your Bold BI server dashboards like this based on your need. Let's run the ASP.NET Core application. Now the ASP.NET Core application is launched. And you can explore your dashboards that you've embedded in the ASP.NET Core application. In this video, we have seen how to compile and run the embedded sample code of Bold BI. Please leave a comment or any questions you may have or any additional features that you would like to see in Bold BI. Thanks for watching.